Welcome to Storytime. I'm Jesse from the Fountain Valley Branch, and today we're going to be reading We Are Water Protectors, written by Carol Lindstrom, illustrated by Michaela Goad. Thanks to Macmillan Publishing for letting us read this. Water is the first medicine, Nokomis told me. We come from water. It nourished us inside our mother's body as it nourishes us here on Mother Earth. Water is sacred, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. The river's rhythm runs through my veins, runs through my people's veins. My people talk of a black snake that will destroy the land. Spoil the water, poison plants and animals, wreck everything in its path. When my people first spoke of the black snake, they foretold that it wouldn't come for many, many years. Now the black snake is here, its venom burns the land, courses through the water, making it unfit to drink. Take courage! I must keep the black snake away from my village's water. I must rally my people together. To stand for the water, to stand for the land, to stand as one against the black snake. We stand with our songs and our drums we are still here. It will not be easy. We fight for those who cannot fight for themselves. The winged ones, the crawling ones, the four-legged, the two-legged, the plants, trees, rivers, lakes, the earth. We are all related. Tears like waterfalls stream down tracks down my face, tracks down my people's faces. Water has its own spirit, Nokomis told me. Water is alive. Water remembers our ancestors who came before us, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. We are stewards of earth. Our spirits have not been broken. We are water protectors. We stand. The black snake is in for the fight of its life. The end. And that was We Are Water Protectors, written by Carol Lindstrom, illustrated by Michaela Goad. Thanks again to Macmillan Publishing for letting us read this. We hope you had fun, and we'll see you in the next story time. Bye.